everybody. Today, Rado runs down Big Dig, which is a roll and write game of sorts where two to four players are excavators chasing the Big Dig as fast as they can. And the way you set it up is each player gets one of these dry erase boards. So I'm going to do a two player right now. They're all two sided, but everybody has to be working on the same side. So we'll just go like this uh, for me and Jen. And we have to put out the five dig cards, just kind of uh, flip some of them so we get a different combination because these are all two-sided. So these are the five digging patterns we can do. And finally, we need three objectives. And you can see there's a whole bunch of them. Let's see what we get this game. We have got uh, excavating the tablet. You can see that stone tablet. To excavate it, we have to empty out every space around it. We can't dig on the tablet itself. We have to dig around it completely to excavate it. We are trying to deliver oil, which means this oil has to, we have to get a line all the way from the oil up to the oil truck. And finally, I don't know what's the last one going to be. It's going to be... Uh, connecting the pipes. You can see there's these two pipes. So we have to have a line from here to here. We have to have a line from there to there. And we have to have this completely dug out as fast as possible. And there's plenty of other ones like excavate all the coins. You can see there's coins scattered around or the amethyst or uh, there's a water delivery from the water to the water tower. There's a fossil, another thing you can excavate and exploding stones or digging out the center spaces. All right. But this is our goal. We are racing to do it. And before we get going, since I am the first player, the second player gets the benefit of one free X. The third player gets two X's, the fourth player gets three X's to make up for the first player advantage. Because the first player to complete all three of these objectives instantly wins. So, I'm first, which means Jen gets a little bit of a bonus. She has to start from any of these spaces along the top. Since we're having to deliver oil, she'll start right here. So, that gives Jen just a little bit of a leg up, and now we are off to the big dig. I will go first. And which one do I want to take? I will... Ooh, this is nice. I'll take this piece. And now, when you dig, you can rotate it, you can mirror it, you can't flip it. This is not available. I can only use this shape any way I want. I will go ahead and go like this. Um, bip, 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 bip. I got a coin, which does not matter because we don't have a coin. But hey, I have gotten two of the ten spaces excavated around. And I've started to make a line that's going to ultimately hit over here. And Neil can work on connecting those also. All right, so I take that. That's gone. I leave uh, the other ones for Jen. What does she want? She will take... Hmm. She'll just go on ahead and take this straight and go one, two, three, four. So she's working her way down. She's leaving the, these. And okay, doke. Let's go on ahead and get the old classic Tetris T. Bip, 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 bip. Okay, Jen has got these ones. And where does she want to go now? All right, she wants to come around here like this. No, neither of those work particularly well for that particular goal. But I mean, she knows she has to come down this way as well. So actually, she'll go ahead and grab this one. All right, which she'll go like this. Bing, 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 bing. So she's getting ready to start connecting these two lines. And she's got, you know, one side of the excavation done. So she's left me that. And what am I going to do? Uh, the old uh, Tetris S. I can go right through. I need another straight like this. I don't want to go squiggling around. But remember, i got to go connect from here to here. And i got to go all the way down there, too. Let's just use the S of thusly. Bing, 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 bing. And I'm going deep. All right, so that's that. It's Jen's turn. But what we got to do is we got to take all the cards, flip them to the other side. So now we have all the other shapes available to us. The 10 shapes are in every game, but it's just a question of in what way will they be available. And it's Jen's turn, and she continues. All righty. Let's have her take this one, nice big long one, and she will mirror it and go bing, 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 bing. All right, so now she has to get this space, and she will have gotten one of the two pipes on her network there. And, okay, she's left me all of this business. I think I'm just going to keep on going down, down to Oil Town uh, with this staircase. I'm going to mirror it and go one, two, one, two, one. Oh, oh, oh hold on, hold on. Got to look out. Oops. Um, because I was about to hit these. Now, these, these square spaces, you cannot dig through. You're also not allowed to dig through either of the ancient artifacts. So, uh, that didn't work out quite well, but if I go bing, 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 oh no! If I go bing, 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 oh no! If I go bing, 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 hey, that's good, all right, so... 
Bing, 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 bing. And I threaded the needle right through there, heading towards that oil. Now, if you have a situation where you do need to get through one of these gray things, it, when you take a card, instead of using it for the dig pattern it says, you can instead discard the card and blow up any one beige or gray square. In some cases, you might have to do that. There actually is an objective where you have to uh, explode five stones, which means you'll have to basically waste um, five of these. Anyway, so I'm down there. Jen's working a different angle. Which way is she going to go now? She'll go on ahead and take this one and go... Uh, oh, what the heck? She'll just go... One, two, three. There we go. So she's getting closer. She just has a single there. All right, we should worry about that later. Back to me. I'm almost to my oil. Almost to my oil. If I take this, I can't because it'll smash into that. Could I go thusly? I could go, I could go like that. It's kind of wasteful. All right, but I can't, remember, I've also got to go like this. I, I, could just, I could just take this and go like, uh, go like this. Bing, 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 bing. All right, so I'm starting to work that line. And it's unfortunate that there's not an objective. One of them is clear out this entire center, which I'm almost done with, but that's that. And so I've left Jen this square, which she will just use here. Bing, 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 bing. She's collected crystal, but it doesn't matter. We don't need crystals this game, but she's getting closer and closer. So that was Jen's turn. It is my turn. We take all the cards, once again, flip them back to their original configuration. And we continue racing. I'm almost to the oil. Jen's almost to both of these. Um, neither of us. We both kind of ignored excavating the tablet. But it's my turn again. Jen just did that. I'll take this and get back to work on my tablet. One, two, three, four. Isn't that nice? Now just two more and I will have that completed. And um, Jen says, ah, oh, she would have... No, nope. yeah, she could have done the same and gone right there. But what will Jen do? I see Jen needs to get down to the oil as well. And and unfortunately, she, you know, this. Oh, well, yeah, this will do. This will do. It's a little bit wasteful, but she'll go like this. Bing, 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 bing. All righty. So she's getting down to the oil also. And it's back to me. And I got these three. So, what the heck? I'll just go on ahead and take uh, this. The old S, one, two, three, four. I'm almost to the oil. I've almost completed one of the objectives. And Jen says she will go, she'll take this one, and boom, she has done the oil. So, objective completed for Jen. Now, she does, so needs to get these three spaces in, this space, and these spaces filled in. And I'm right on her tail, uh, grabbing this one. And what am I going to do with it? I'm not quite sure. But I think I'll stop right there, because folks, you should have a pretty good idea of the gameplay that Big Dig offers. This is a very sweet, fast-playing, charming little... It's not a roll and right, because you don't roll. Instead, you draft cards. Um, but it's a race, and it works. It's a, it, the, its strength is, it's easily under 10 minutes. It's very quick. Uh, it's nice with dry erase markers, so it's easy to, you know, to just basically reset. Just go whoop, and you've cleaned it off, and you're good to go again. A nice combination of different objectives. Give you slightly unique feels, but I will say, uh, for all its strengths, this is a super-duper lightweight game. This is probably the lightest roll and write, which, is, again, it's not a roll and write. Uh, but I'm just going to, you know, it's, it's the lightest writing game I've played after a year and a half of some really cool gamery ones. This I can see being very, very good for fans families with young children. Or maybe if you're trying to introduce total muggles, because this is a great little gateway uh, you can carry with you anywhere in your pocket. Interestingly, the box though, it's very, very difficult to get this box open, I've found. I don't know if that's just uh, this pre-production copy I've got or not. But that's a minor thing, um, but it is, uh, like I said, a great little portable game. I can see this uh, wonderful to give to the kids in the back seat of the car, and, and somebody can play in the front seat with them, because uh, you don't need to have a flat surface, because these are nice, thick, uh, dry race markers as everybody just races to finish the big dig. And that's the rundown, folks. Thanks for watching. Have a very nice day. Talk to you later. So long. Uh, bye bye.